Medicare is something you've earned, a benefit you count on. Understanding how it works, how to navigate and make the most of it, however, is no easy task, especially if you try it on your own. Trusted impartial guidance from Aon can help you make sense of original Medicare and individual Medicare plans that can help you complete your coverage needs. We'll help you understand your options so you can make the right decision for your health. Welcome to Medicare Made Easy, brought to you by Aon. Who is Aon? We're a leading global insurance brokerage firm backed by a century of insurance expertise. We offer a broad range of Medicare plans, such as Medicare Advantage, Medicare Supplement, and Prescription Drug. We also help you evaluate your options, compare plans, and sign up when you're ready. Whether you rely on our secure website or prefer to speak to one of our licensed advisors, our services are always free. You only pay for the plans you enroll in. We've helped enroll over 600,000 Medicare customers, and now we are here for you. No wonder Anne is recommended by the National Council on Aging and rated A plus by the Better Business Bureau. <clears throat> by the end of this webinar, you should have a better understanding of how you will enroll when you're Medicare eligible. Anne's services are provided at no extra cost to you, your friends, and family. Let's take a look at the topics we'll cover today. We'll start with Medicare basics, then we'll talk about plan options and plan coverages, your enrollment checklist, how periods, and at the end, we'll answer some common questions. You can count on Aon to show you the way. Medicare is a federal program that offers health insurance to Americans and other eligible individuals. To be covered by Medicare, you must be a U.S. citizen or legal resident who has lived in the U.S. continuously for at least the last five years, including the five years just before applying for Medicare. You must also meet one of these criteria age 65 or older, younger than 65 with a qualifying disability, any age with a diagnosis of end-stage renal disease, also known as ESRD, or amyotrophic lateral sclerosis, also known as ALS. Since you are turning age 65, you have something called the initial enrollment period. This period allows you to enroll in Medicare A and B starting three months before the month of your birthday, the month of your birthday, and three months after, which is a seven-month window. But we recommend enrolling a few months before you turn age 65. Keep in mind that it may take up to 60 days to get approved for Medicare Part B and up to three weeks to receive your Medicare card in the mail. Many people who are still working sign up for Medicare Part A at 65, but delay signing up for Part B if they're covered by their employer's insurance. This also applies to spouses covered under their working spouse's group health plan. If you didn't sign up for Medicare Part B when you were first eligible because you had a group health plan, you can sign up during a special enrollment period when you lose group coverage. You must sign up for Medicare Part B no later than eight months after you lose group coverage, or you may have to pay a lifetime penalty and experience a gap in coverage. Original Medicare Parts A and B helps pay for hospital stays and doctor visits, but it doesn't cover everything, nor does it cover prescription drugs. We will cover the difference between original Medicare and individual Medicare plans in the next section. You must have Medicare Parts A and B before enrolling in an individual Medicare plan through Aon, such as Medicare Advantage or Medicare Supplement Plan. You can sign up for original Medicare in one of three ways. If you are not collecting Social Security, you will need to either visit the local Social Sec Security office, call Social Security directly, or access the Social Security website to enroll in Medicare Parts A and B. If you are collecting Social Security when turning age 65, you will automatically be enrolled in Medicare A and B, and your Medicare card, your red, white, and blue card will be mailed out to you a few months before turning age 65. Over time, your healthcare needs and budget may change. That's why there are options that allow you to select benefits that support those needs. Let's take a closer look at your Medicare options. Once you are enrolled in Medicare Parts A and B through Social Security Administration, you are ready to complete your coverage needs with an individual Medicare plan from Aon. 
Many people choose additional coverage by enrolling in one or more individual Medicare plans. We will review more detailed coverage information in the next section. For now, let's take a closer look at how Medicare plans are grouped. Keep in mind, this is a high level comparison. You can choose to stay with original Medicare, Part A covers hospital stays and Part B helps with doctors and outpatient hospital visits, but it doesn't cover everything, nor does it cover prescription drugs. As Medicare has evolved, the federal government allowed private insurance companies to offer additional options that cover a wider range of services to help manage the out-of-pocket costs. Because original Medicare doesn't pay for everything, you may want to consider a Medicare Advantage plan or a Medicare supplement plan along with a prescription drug plan. Some plans come with hearing and vision care benefits as well. Medicare Advantage plans combined medical benefits as good as those covered by Medicare Part A and Part B, but with greater financial protection. Many Medicare Advantage plans also include Medicare prescription drug coverage. Medicare supplement plans, also known as Medigap, are designed to fill the gaps of Medicare Parts A and B. However, these plans do not cover prescription drugs. When you choose a Medicare supplement plan, you must enroll in a separate prescription drug plan. Now that you understand the Medicare plan combinations available to you, let's review the plan coverage in more detail. We'll start with original Medicare. Medicare Part A is your inpatient hospital care and covers inpatient hospital care, hospice care, and home health care. There is a deductible for Part A. This is not your typical annual deductible. This deductible actually resets after a 60-day benefit period, which means you can have this deductible up to five times in a calendar year if you're not having a good year health-wise. For most people, this is premium-free as long as either you or your spouse has worked over 10 years and paid into Social Security. Part B is your outpatient doctor and hospital care, which covers doctor's visits, preventative care, lab tests, and other outpatient services. Most people pay a monthly premium, which typically comes directly out of your Social Security check. Part B also has a yearly deductible. After you have met the deductible, Medicare pays 80% of approved expenses and you pay the remaining 20%. An important fact to remember is the 20% that you are responsible for is uncapped, meaning there is no limit to what out-of-pocket expense you may incur. As you can see, by just having Medicare A and B without any additional coverage, you could be spending a lot of money out of your own pocket in the event you have a serious health issue. Even if a service or item is covered, you'll generally still have to pay deductibles, coinsurance, or copayments without any limit on those costs. This is why many people enroll in Medicare Advantage or a Medigap plan to reduce their out-of-pocket expenses and provide them with greater coverage and protection. Here's a list of what's not covered by Medicare Parts A and B. Even if a service or item is covered, You'll generally still have to pay deductibles, coinsurance, or copayments without any limit on those costs. If you join a Medicare Advantage plan, sometimes abbreviated as Part C or MA plan, you still have original Medicare, which is Parts A and B but a private insurance company is responsible for coordinating your care and paying claims. You'll usually pay a monthly premium for your Medicare Advantage plan, but in most cases there are no deductibles. You'll pay a copayment instead of coinsurance for most medical services. These plans have an out-of-pocket maximum, which protects you by setting a yearly cap on your costs for health services. Remember, Original Medicare has no out-of-pocket maximums. If you need a prescription drug coverage, check the plan to be sure your medications are covered. Most include drug coverage. These are network-based plans like HMOs and PPOs. Check that your preferred doctors and specialists participate in the plan's provider network or accept Medicare depending on which plan type you choose. Lastly, you'll have the convenience of one card for all services. The last plan combination starts with a Medicare Supplement Plan, also known as a Medigap Plan. 
This plan is designed to fill in the gaps of original Medicare. There are a variety of standardized Medicare supplement plans to choose from. Each plan provides different benefits, so it's important to compare plans before choosing one. You'll pay a monthly premium for a Medicare supplement plan in addition to your monthly Medicare Part B premium. There are no networks. You can use any medical facility or physician that accepts Medicare nationwide. It does not include the drug coverage. You will need to purchase a standalone prescription drug plan. Medicare prescription drug plans, also known as Part D, cover much of the cost for prescription drugs and can be useful in situations where prescription drugs aren't already covered. Most plans offer mail order service or pick up at a local pharmacy. Each plan has a list of drugs that it covers, known as a formulary. The federal government sets basic guidelines that all Part D plans must meet. Part D plans can be a part of a Medicare Advantage plan or a standalone drug plan. It's very important to note that all the plans that you will be comparing and enrolling in are single person plans. There are no family plans available in the Medicare world that will cover both you and spouse under the same policy like you see in most group plans. Remember that you can sign up for Medicare until three months before you turn 65. Ready to enroll? Before you begin, you'll save time if you gather everything you'll need to refer to during the enrollment process. This includes documents, personal information, and medical information. Examples are your Medicare ID card, healthcare information such as prescriptions and names of preferred doctors and hospitals. Your time to enroll into Medicare is approaching fast and you'll soon need to make some big decisions. Choices that will affect your all important health coverage plus your financial long-term finances. But you can relax because Aon has you covered. Online, you get the convenience of 24 seven shopping plus educational information you need to make informed decisions about your healthcare coverage. Through our private Medicare exchange, Aon gives you access to plans from more than 100 of the nation's top Medicare insurers. What is a private Medicare exchange? Let's talk about what that means. Think of it as a marketplace where you're able to shop for and purchase individual Medicare plans from a variety of different insurance companies. Plans are offered by names you know, like Anthem, Aetna, Cigna, as well as regional plans from your local insurance companies. Sound overwhelming? Don't worry, our personalized plan tool matches you to personalized choices based on a few simple questions, and we'll cover more on that later. We have online resources and education available 24-7 to, to help guide you through every step of the way. The plans that we offer have the exact premium and coverage that you would get directly from the insurance carrier. Once you've chose a plan, the secure online enrollment process walks you through each step. Along with our online resources, we offer a network of licensed advisors available by phone. Friendly, high trained and licensed professionals ready to answer all your questions and give you smart, impartial guidance and enrollment support. We can also accommodate the hearing impaired and have language assistance for those who prefer to speak in another language. The best news, Aon services are provided at no additional cost to you. Technology is power, especially when it comes to making good Medicare decisions. With our easy to use website, you get 24 seven access to a recommendation tool that lets you compare plans based on your personal healthcare needs. With a few simple questions, you significantly reduce your shopping time and get optimal coverage for your visits and prescriptions. You can also view plans ranked by your own preferences, such as premium and total estimated out-of-pocket costs, or filter by network types and insurance companies. It's a one-stop shop where you can learn, compare, and enroll. Let's take a quick look at the website. From Aon's website, you can get additional educational information about Medicare and additional coverage options. When you're ready to find Medicare plans, just enter your zip code here. 
We recommend creating an account to save your information and plan choices if you need to come back later. For your security, we don't save your online history without your permission. When you're ready to enroll, easily log into your account and retrieve your saved plans. Don't worry, our licensed advisors are available to help if you need to speak with us. Now let's take a closer look at the plan recommendation tool. Enter your zip code here to get started. By answering a few additional questions about yourself and your coverage needs, we can help you narrow down your coverage options and select a plan. You can also skip this section if you already know the plans you want. To take advantage of the plan recommendation tool, click Help Me Find a Plan. On the top of the page is your status bar. There are four short sections that will ask about you, your medications, providers, and coverage needs. On this first page, answer a few basic questions to set up your coverage profile. For this example, if your 65th birthday is October 20th, you would select October 1st for the coverage to begin because Medicare allows start on the first of the month. After you're done with these questions, click on the next section to add your medications. If you don't take any prescriptions, just click the next button. If you are Once you select name, dosage, and your refill information, click here to add it. You can add more medications, or if you're done, click the next bus button, search for your preferred physicians and hospitals. Adding your provider information helps us recommend plans that include your doctors and hospitals in the networks. Letting us know how often you used medical services in the past helps us estimate what your future out-of-pocket costs might be. This information will be used for your plan score and estimated costs only, and will not impact your eligibility or premiums for any plan. Setting up an account makes shopping for plans easier. Your information and preferences will be saved to your personal profile, and you can even enroll online. Once you get the plans, there are three different tabs, and this page starts with the Medicare Advantage tab, and you will see all the plans we represent below that tab. Take note to the rating score symbol. You can see in this example, the plan has a score of 95. The tool used your answers to evaluate the suitability of each plan. All eligible plans are evaluated and assigned a score between 0 and 100, with higher scores indicating greater suitability. If you want more information on why this plan scored this way, just click Explanation. You can also see a Medicare Supplement tab and a Prescription Drug tab. Make sure you click on all three tabs to see all the plans available in your area. The plans are sorted by score when you use the Plan Recommendation tool. But you have other sort and filter options on the top of the screen here. You can sort by premium, insurance company, and total cost. You can apply filters to narrow down your search based on your preferred network type, insurance company, or even preferred providers. Scroll down to view other plans. If you want more plan information, select View Plan Details. You can also compare up to three plans side by side. If you like a plan, add it to your cart. Just like on Amazon, when you buy something, you add it to your cart first. Most plans allow you to complete your enrollment online at your convenience 24 seven. Be sure to complete and confirm all required fields on the application. Some information will be pre-filled for your convenience and then move through each step of the checkout process. 
Once you complete your application, follow any special instructions you receive to complete the process, including either an electronic signature or voice signature. Need help from our licensed advisors? We're happy to help. You have many options to get in touch with us by chat, email, or phone. The licensed advisor will walk you through the application over the phone. They will go through all the questions with you, and at the end of the call, they will get a verbal signature from you. You will confirm that you want to enroll in that plan. All that information is recorded and gathered and sent immediately to the insurance carrier company for processing. Once you have enrolled in your new coverage, you may receive a call from your new carrier. Do not ignore this call. They are calling to verify your enrollment and you will need to call them back or you may be disenrolled from your coverage. Next, let's talk about enrollment periods. There are four types. The first is the initial enrollment period, which is what you may be in if you're about to turn 65. The initial enrollment period begins three months prior to your 65th birthday, the month of your 65th birthday, and three months after your 65th birthday. Second is the Medicare open enrollment period. This occurs every year from October 15th through December 7th. During this time frame, you can change your Medicare Advantage plan and prescription plan, drug plans, or Part D. Third, Medicare supplement plans. They don't have enrollment periods. You can change from one supplement company to another any month of the year, but in most situations, you'll need to answer the health questions on the application before being approved. And fourth, there could be a special enrollment period. For example, you may move to a different state where your current plans are not available. You will be able to select from any plans in the new state. Once you have enrolled into the right plans for you, the insurance companies have three different options for paying for your premiums. The first option is the traditional method of writing out a check for the premium and mailing it into the insurance company each billing cycle. Second, the second option is setting up an automatic debit that will come directly out of a checking or savings account. This is the preferred method because once you set it up, it will come out automatically on a monthly basis. You don't have to worry about your premium being paid. Your benefit advisor can help you set it up during the application process. And your third option, which is only for Medicare Advantage plans and Part D prescription drug plans, is having your premium automatically deducted from your Social Security check. Aon gives you access to plans from more than 100 of the nation's top Medicare insurers. We have online resources and education available 24-7 to help guide you through every step of the way. The plans that we offer have the exact premium and coverage that you would get directly from the insurance company. Secure online enrollment or through our highly trained and licensed advisors. Our services are offered at no additional cost to you. Now we've completed the general topics of Medicare. Let's run through the answers to common questions. <clears throat> Do I have to pay to use the AM Retiree Health Exchange services? No. As a part of the benefits you get by enrolling through us, you get impartial, personalized guidance throughout your Medicare experience. Our services are offered at no additional cost to you. You only pay the cost of the coverage you choose. I am turning 65 but still working and have group insurance through my company. Can I still apply for an individual plan with Aon? You must have Medicare Part A and B before enrolling with Aon. What if I have a pre-existing condition? When you enroll through us during the initial enrollment period, you can't be charged more or denied coverage or treatment based on health status. If you don't enroll during the initial enrollment period, you may only have original Medicare coverage, and you may be subject to underwriting if you enroll in supplemental coverage after the enrollment period. What if part of Minnesota and the other part in Florida? Will I be covered? There are many plan options that may be able to accommodate your situation. Be sure to have this dual resident conversation with a licensed advisor so they can help you select a plan that and requirements and whichever plan you select will determine the amount of your out-of-pocket expenses. Can we change plans after the initial enrollment one year to the 
conditions apply. Possibly. After your initial open enrollment or special election period, you will not have guaranteed acceptance into a Medicare supplement plan. Wait until after the guaranteed issue period ends, you may be subject to underwriting. This means you may have health questions on the application. Based upon your responses, the carrier will determine if you'll be accepted into the premium. It's always a good idea to talk with a licensed advisor when deciding to change your plan. Feel free to call with any questions at the phone number listed in the communications you receive from us. We can also help your friends and family. Thank you.